United Nations Office for West Africa and Sahel has advised the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, political actors and security agencies to put in mechanisms that would effectively address any issues arising from political campaigns and election misconduct come 2023. At a one-day summit in Kaduna, the Commission said peace must be prioritized, stressing the need for candidates and their supporters to shun acts that could breach it. Even that Kaduna State is unfortunately not spared by some of the challenges facing the country, it is incumbent on us to close ranks and prioritize all engagements that would promote peace, security and development before, during, and after the elections. To amplify our commitment to peace and agree on more practical ways of addressing threats that may undermine a peaceful electoral process. In situation of rancor, intimidation, gang terrorism, robbery, and violence, candidates and political parties will not have a conducive atmosphere to inform and attract support of the citizens, of the electorate. It is therefore needless for candidates and political parties to associate themselves with such practices during campaigns and elections. We therefore urge our political actors and the political leaders throughout the state to ensure peaceful campaigns and elections and dissociate themselves with actions capable of disturbing public order. It's not just the absence of war. Peace means also the presence of human rights, the presence of food on the table, the presence of job for people. And every single election, we gather and call for peaceful elections. Once the elections are over, it's difficult to know whether people have employment, whether people have jobs, whether people have food, whether people have good roads. And not only preaching for peaceful elections. We are also preaching that people's rights be respected. Approaching a very delicate and dangerous, you know, period. Please and please, you know, uh, we should stick to the rules of the game. That is the rule of law. Nothing extra. If an offender is found, treat him according to, you know, the rule of law and then we will have peace in our communities. The challenges we have in our community, respect for the rule of law, respect you know, for the authorities, constituted authorities, and, that, and then not punishing an offender adequately, it leads to impunity. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.